Hi everyone, welcome back to another vlog. Hope you all are safe and keeping well. In today's video, sharing with you all a beautiful countryside property. So stay tuned and watch this video till the end. You'll definitely love it. The model of this property is called Foz. This is a bright and airy detached home with a layout that makes the most of available light. Now going with the floor plans. In the ground floor, you have a beautiful and spacious living room. You also have an open plan kitchen with dining, which benefits from an extra family space and also a water closet. And in the first floor, you have three bedrooms with two double bedrooms, one ensuite in the master bedroom and a common bathroom. Now, as you enter the house, you'll find a lengthy hall, which has different separations made towards your living room, washroom, kitchen and dining and also to the central staircase. Now to begin with, let's explore the living room. As you can see, the living room is bright and airy. It's very beautiful and spacious. These properties have light interiors and they're really putting great deal in creating spaces which people love. You also have the French door access towards the garden behind. It's a quite spacious and beautiful garden. This is all about the living room. Now moving towards the other rooms. As you come out of the living room, you have the washroom in the ground floor opposite to it. It's a small washroom. It's got all the facilities inside it. There's a water closet, sink, and also there's a window on the other side. You also have the mains of the house in this washroom. Now moving towards the kitchen and dining areas. The best thing about these countryside properties are its kitchen and living spaces. They have designed it in a really beautiful way. This is an open plan kitchen and dining which benefits from an extra family area. So towards one side you have the bright kitchen with all the modern fittings and appliances. There's a boiler fitted in here at the corner of this kitchen. Lot of storage cupboards are provided on top and even at the bottom. You also have the integrated refrigerator, freezer and also the oven. Most of these branded appliances are inbuilt and they come along with the property. Overall it's a beautiful kitchen space. As I told you this is a lengthy kitchen with dining and also family space included. There are also some small rooms attached to this like utility and also a small storeroom which I'll be sharing with you later. So this is the dining space in between. You can have a very big table with 6 to 8 chairs easily. You also have a beautifully designed window straight to this. Now this is the beautiful family area with large skylights and French doors leading onto the garden. These beautifully designed kitchen and living spaces carry the signature of style and character. They definitely reflect towards the commitment of quality. Now before leaving the kitchen, we'll just cover another two rooms. Uh, in one of these small rooms, it's kind of like a utility. You have the washing machine kept inside it. There's also one more uh, small storeroom. This is the space under the staircase, which is converted. So you can have some kind of storage in here. This is all about the kitchen. Now moving towards the first floor. As I told you, in the first floor, you have three different bedrooms with two double bedrooms and one ensuite facilities in the master bedroom with the common bathroom. Now exploring the master bedroom of the house. Now this master bedroom is again spacious. It's quite bright and airy. As 
I really love the design of these windows here. They're beautifully designed. You get some extra space in that corner. In addition to having a double court, you can also have a dressing table and there's plenty of room to walk around. You have two sets of inbuilt cupboards on the other side with a partition in between uh, towards the bathroom. Now exploring the ensuite, you have a walk-in shower, water closet and a wash basin. There's also a window towards one side. You also get a chrome towel heater, polished mirror and porcelanosa tiles. Now moving towards the next room. This is a small room. The space is lesser when compared to the master bedroom. This can be used as a kid's bedroom or you can convert it into a storeroom or study, office space, anything you want to. Now exploring the second double bedroom of the house. This is a double bedroom but then the size is smaller than the master bedroom. So a normal cot fits in and you have plenty of room to walk around. There's a window towards one side. You also have inbuilt shelves on the other side. So definitely a good size second bedroom with all the facilities. Now moving towards the common bathroom in the first floor. This has got a bathtub, walk-in shower, water closet and also wash basin on the other side. You have two windows on both sides, so there's plenty of light and air movement. Now just beside the bathroom, there is a small room with door and lock. You can use it as a clock room or just use it as some storage space. We covered all the rooms in the first floor. This is all about today's property. I hope you liked watching my today's video. Do give me your suggestions and feedback in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. Make sure to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on my future videos. Thanks for watching. See you in another vlog.